In the area of police reform and justice for the victims of police violence, the fight continues in Baltimore County, Maryland, just a few miles from where I am today. It is time to pay the jury award in the Corinne Gaines wrongful death case. On August 1st, 2016, Corinne Gaines was shot in the back and killed while in her apartment. And her then five-year-old son, Cody, was shot and maimed by Baltimore County Police Officer Corporal Royce Ruby after police went to her apartment to serve a warrant for failing to appear in court for a traffic ticket. Corinne Gaines was having a behavioral health crisis, yet Corporal Ruby recklessly shot Corinne Gaines in the back, threw the drywall in her kitchen with a military assault rifle, and then fired additional rounds into her body after she was initially injured by the first shot. Corporal Ruby was sued for wrongful death, excessive force, and for violating the civil rights of Corinne Gaines and her son, Cody. After a three-week trial, the jury determined Officer Ruby's blind shot into the back of Corinne Gaines was unreasonable. Corinne Gaines' son, Cody, who was five years old at the time, was also struck by the reckless shot. The jury also found that Cody's constitutional rights were violated. Not only was Cody present when his mother was killed, he has endured several reconstructive surgeries for his injuries and continues intensive trauma support from his exposure to the excessively violent act of Corporal Ruby, who was never disciplined nor has ever been charged. This Baltimore County jury awarded Cody and the Gaines family $38 million, the largest jury award for a police wrongful death suit to date. However, the portion of the judgment that pertains to Cody for his injuries and trauma, almost $33 million, remains unpaid. Sources tell us that the county settlement offer for now 10-year-old Cody's trauma and injuries was $1 million in a total disregard of the jury's legal verdict and award. This is the kind of governmental indifference and outright hostility that says black lives really don't matter in Baltimore County. We will continue to put pressure on Johnny Olszewski, Johnny O, the county executive, to fulfill his legal and moral obligation to pay the jury award to a little boy who himself was shot in the same incident in which his mother was slaughtered in his presence.